This is Quinn. Hi. I recruited her as a newbie angler. Uh, you fish before, right? Um, just on the rivers back home in Missouri. Never on a pier in California. Never on a pier. Okay, so this is going to be a new experience for her, and she's going to catch so many fish, she's just going to be amazed. Well, I was never very good at the catching part. Well, you're so. going to catch some today. <laughs> <laughs> going to catch some today. We're going to start off with a light tackle, and we're going to use. I'm going to start her off actually using some lug worms, which is uh, pretty much guarantees catching fish. So first, you want to shake hands with your rod or your reel. Okay. I always tell people. Some people never never used a reel. Yeah. So they don't even know how to hold it. So basically, all you're doing, is you're shaking hands with it. You're shaking hands with it, and you're what you're doing is you're putting your second finger around here uh -huh. and holding it like that. Got it. Let me bait up before you do this. Okay. I'm going to use some lug worms. Mm -hmm. Small hook. I shake hands with the thing. I take this second finger. That's where you're going to grab your line. Okay. You're going to turn your bail. Okay. Because of all this kelp today, we're not going to try casting out because you'll get tangled in the kelp. So we're just going to drop it down straight. Now, if you drop to the bottom, we're going to catch a small kelp bass, but you don't want. Okay. Um, Mid-water, you may catch um, opali if you're lucky. You may catch uh, half moon, a whole plethora of fish, uh, senioritas, rock rassi. Um, so, you know, so we're going to drop it. So we're just going to take it. We're going to drop it down like this. Okay. We're just going to drop it down until you can't see it. And you can't see the, see we can see it now, right? We can yeah. see the sinker and the bait. Yep. We're going to drop it down just enough where we can't, it's out of sight, and that's where we're going to start fishing. Okay, so you're going to do it. How long do you leave it down there, Ken? Until you catch fish. <laughs> okay, okay, so you're going to shake hands. Uh-huh. You take that second finger and get your line. Okay. You're going to twist it, turn your bail. There you go. You're going to just drop it down. Oh, I think I. Oh. <laughs> nope, it'll be, it'll, you'll feel like they like they're sucking it into their mouth is what you're gonna. Yeah, feel like. I think they're gone. No more bites. No more bites. Then pull it up. Let's see if you got your bait. I bet you they did. They were never. Well, you also got your bar. bait. Drop it back down. Okay, drop it back down. Yep. Take your Put finger, my finger, finger on there, it. Finger there. Bring Flip that and then kind of let it go. Yes, let it go down. If I don't okay, see it. stop about there. Okay. There you go. Just let it sit there. Oh, they're pulling again. Yeah. So there are fish down there. Oh, they're pulling a fair bit. I think I got one. <laughs> there you go. You got, no. you got off. No, you got it's off. off. Drop it down a little bit more. Okay. 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 Pull it, see if you get your stuff bait. Okay. We're going to read bait. Okay. Okay, so I got my thing. Shake it, shake it. I mean, yep. Shake down. Got that. Flip that. Drop it down. Okay. No, he got off. No, he got off. Oh, he's on there. No, he's gone. No, he's beyond there. You got one. I got a fish. <laughs> this is only my second fish in my life. <laughs> that is a senorita fish. Oh my goodness! Look at that. So she's got her first. Senorita fish. <laughs> Look at it. Oh, <laughs> that's awesome. They're also known as bait stealers. That's why she was getting all those bites. <laughs> that's pretty cool. And so now we throw these back because it's too yes, little. Yes. Yeah. So Just a little thing. I grab it. Work the hook out like oh, that. And then go again. Pull it. Oh, just a little thing? What is it? There's something on there. Oh, we got a little kelp bass. So I got a kelp bass too. Well, I think that was a group effort. I got to give you half the credit <laughs> on that one. At least half the credit. So how do you take it off without losing your rod in the ocean? Okay, I just grab it carefully. Uh-huh. And just work the hook, hopefully work the hook free like that. Okay. And the hard ones are like the Garibaldi and some of the others that have a real tough mouth. Oh. Usually kelp bass are easy. Anyone can do fishing. Yeah, that anybody is. can do it. 
Yeah, it's really not, not that big of a mystery. No. no, it's patience, right? Patience. And understanding the behaviors of the fish, so you know where to, how long to leave it in, or like how deep to drop it yeah. and whatnot. Yeah, anyone can do it. It's really fun. Yeah, once you learn the different kind of fish, what the different fish like to eat upon. Yeah. And oh, something's new. What area they're in, the bottom. Yeah. Top, whatever. Yeah. That's that's a lot of it, and the last thing is just developing the uh, the feel. You got it. You got it. Oh, Oops, he, came right, he came off right at the last right at minute. The top, right at the top. Yep. Yes. <laughs> Largest room in the world is room for improvement. Yes. And no such thing as problems, only opportunity. That's true. It all applies to fishing. It does, and why? They just got to develop the feel a little bit. There's a little yeah. bit of developing the feel for what. There is, isn't there? Yeah. For what? No, no, just when to pull it up. Pull it up. That yep. just takes time to learn. Yeah, it does. So good luck. Thanks. <laughs> okay, we hope that you watch our pier fishing videos. We have two aims. One aim is to educate people how to be better anglers. And secondly, we hope you entertain you a little bit. I hope you enjoy these films. Watch the films. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and keep watching.